this is a video on how to disable write protect on a chromebook some chromebooks you use crew as is right protect others doesn't use the screw so we we'll have to check our motherboard to see if we have the right protect screw or we don't have the right protect screw on this type of chromebook so to do that we have to unscrew the screws from the back of the cover so i will just pause the video for a while and then remove the rubber bands and unscrew it now that all the screws have been removed i'll use my flat screwdriver and then pop the back cover open you can use any sharp object that you can find maybe a small knife or a flat surfaced object so let's check if the board has the right project screw okay let's check um, hold on usually the right project screw is a screw with wp beside it wp beside it right protect short form of right protect beside it so i cannot see any screw with WP by it so this means that my Chromebook doesn't use the screw as a right protect so um, <clears throat> to disable the right protect on this type of Chromebook you have to disable the battery and use some codes to disable it but First, we need to put our Chromebook in developer mode. So I'll just put the back of the cover back without screwing it. If your Chromebook uses the right protect screw, all you need to do is to unscrew it and the right protect will be disabled. So with my own, I have to use the other method. I'll just cover it back and then put my Chromebook in developer mode for the course to work or to disable the right protect you need to put it in developer mode before you start using the course and then disconnecting the battery to use the course I'll put the cover back without screwing it because I'll deattach the battery from the Chromebook and then attach it back later but first let's put our Chromebook into developer mode to put your chromebook in developer mode we are going to press the escape refresh and power buttons simultaneously please remember um, if you have any files you want to back up you should do it now because putting it in developer mode will clear everything every file you have on the chromebook so we will press the escape refresh and then the power button at the same time now you get this screen press ctrl plus d to skip that part so to turn always verification of press enter always verification is off Control D again. Now, uh, your system is transitioning to developer mode. Local data will be cleared. So that's why I said you should back up all your files that you want. You need later. So you can see it will start within 30 seconds. So if you don't want to continue with this process, you can just press the power button to stop. 
and remember this is going to take some time so you might want to plug your adapter into the laptop this plug your laptop will reboot once now press ctrl d now your chromebook is in developer mode yes let's go so you'll be asked to add a wi-fi connect to a network So I'm just going to browse as guest. I'm not going to log in yet. Browse as guest. Browse as guest. Okay. So that was how to put your Chromebook into developer mode. Now that our Chromebook is in developer mode, we can now disable the right protect. So I'll turn the Chromebook off and then disconnect the battery from the board and then use the course so this is the battery so carefully deattach the battery from the board i'll put the cover back without the screws because i'm going to Put the battery back later because we have disconnected the battery we would have to use our AC adapter to power on the Chromebook and then use the cores that will be used to disable the right protect on these kinds of Chromebooks. The Chromebook that I'm using in this tutorial doesn't have the right protect screw. So I'll put the adapter right back into the Chromebook. Oh, well, verification is off. Ctrl D to skip this part. No, I'm going to browse as guest. I don't want to log in yet. Browse as guest. Now press Control Alt T. Control Alt and T at the same time to open crush. Control Control Alt and then T. Now that crush has been opened we will type in shell s h e l l enter now type su s u d o space s h now type flash Room. You leave a space dash dash WP one dash this sorry this able press enter okay now let's check this the two of the right protect if we were actually able to disable it so we will type flash rom flash rom you leave a space two dashes wp one dash status 
so you can see right protect is disabled so that is how to disable right protect on a chromebook without the right protection screw if you have the chromebook with the right protect screw you have to put your chromebook into developer mode and then unscrew the right protect screw from your chromebook if yours doesn't use the right protect screw you follow the steps in this video to disable the right protect and then put the screws 